Hi guys, I'm back with another Instagram puzzle feed. I saw you like the other one. So today you'll learn how to design an Instagram feed layout. I will leave on the screen the dimensions needed. Go to view, new guide layout, write 3 for columns and 6 for rows. Each square will represent a post. Because we want to make the feed look like a huge puzzle, for now we will not take under consideration the guidelines and we will make a background. I decided to make some random shapes with pen tool. You can do the same, feel free to make any kind of shapes. Make sure these shapes don't have a stroke. I made one white to create this effect. It's up to you if you want to do the same. I didn't like this blue, I felt like it will not look great with my photos, so I switched to another color. You will see working in Photoshop that your first decisions are not always your last. Now, with custom shape, I added a few more shapes. Now let's start with the first post that will have a picture inside. Create a shape with rounded rectangle tool. From properties you can change the shape of the corners and make some interesting shapes. Move your photo over the shape, click right, choose create clipping mask. And now click right, blending options and check drop shadow. It can be easier to group your layers. I decided to make a background group and insert all the shapes I made. If you don't feel comfortable with creating groups, it's fine not to do this step. The second picture post will be here. I will create again a shape with rounded rectangle tool and change the shape of the corners. Move another photo over the shape, choose create clipping mask, make it smaller and add some shadow to your shape. You will see that I basically repeat these steps all over again but every time changing a little bit the style to make a creative design. This tutorial is more about being inspired by my design and to learn some small steps. So, one, you have to make shapes with a rectangle tool. Two, 
move your photos over these shapes. Three, click right and choose create clipping mask. Four, make them smaller with Ctrl plus T and drag their corners inside. My idea of design is to have one post with text, another one with a picture and so on. In case you don't want to create a design like this by yourself, either you don't have the time or the Photoshop skills or the creativity, you can count on me to design it for you. You'll find in my description a Fiverr link and you can contact me there. I know right now I'm just repeating steps, but stay until the end to find out all the steps you need to do to make your design perfect. Copy layer style and now go to other shapes to paste style. This step is to put the shadow to more shapes. Now let's make some text posts. Here you can put quotes or your own words, whatever you want. With text tool, create a text box on each free post. I like how quote Mars looks, so I will add a few of them in each text post. Now let's add again some custom shapes, this time over the photos. You can be pretty random about them, but in a way that it still looks nice. If you made this design, send them to me on my Instagram or if you created something similar, feeling inspired by what I did here, send them too. I plan to make another tutorial about how to design an Instagram puzzle feed and I will shout out you in the next video. One of my favorite things to do is to add some white lights. You can create them by making a new layer and using the round soft brush. Also, it should be white and the opacity lower. Other things that can make your design better are textures. Put them over your design and choose as a blend mode, color dodge or screen or any that makes your texture look good. Now with slice tool select each square. Now go to file, export, save for web.
And now you have a lot of new posts for your feed and they all together will look fabulous. Subscribe for more tutorials. It helps us both. Thank you. Have a nice day.